Short hair don't care, baby. Bright lights don't fight. Unbuttoned shirt, if I see your girl, I'm a flirt. Flowers beside me, I be hitting those textbooks, putting hours behind me. What is going on guys, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna do a quick little effing video. My first time drinking some beer, throwing some back with the boys, getting a little head twisted, and getting crazy. Cause it, we, I mean, got pretty fucking crazy. So, drinking the first time, I was very close to the age of 14. I'm not gonna clarify if I was younger or older. Um, you can just use your imagination. You know that that's fucking young to be drinking alcohol. It was my sister's graduation, and they were throwing like this big ass party over at my cousin's house, which was like right through the woods. Like we would just walk through the woods, drive through the woods with a golf cart or a gator. We're country ass people, man, what's up? And there was like a, I mean, there was a lot of people there. It was like a banger. So everybody was over there. We were over at my house. Like we were doing our thing. We we're independent. We're like 14, baby. We're starting to plot. Like we're starting to do some things. We're getting some hair in some places. Anyway, so we're over at the house. It's like probably like 200 yards. Getting mischievous. We're fucking young, wild, and crazy, baby. 14, learning how to read and write. Plus, minus, subtract. Gangster, baby. Learning some shit with PG-13. Like, Rated R, we're on the way, bro. We're on the way to Rated R right now. And we did some Rated R shit, okay? There was a garage, and I think... Some of the kids, because I mean, she's graduating high school, and my other cousin, she's like a year younger and three years older than me, and she was like, they were like hiding their beers or putting their beers in the fridge. I don't think they wanted them to like really know that they were drinking. We found the beers and we fucking cracked it open, dude. First real drink, Bud Light Lime, baby. Bud Light Lime. I mean, that started out being a badass. Like, I just. And then I just grew from there to like only drinking apple ciders now. I've been a little badass the whole time, dude. We got into those. I think we had like three of those. Like we had three each, I think, which is a fuck ton for a 14 year old. And you have no, you had nobody advising you. Like you have nobody telling you this is right or wrong. So then I asked my cousin Chelsea to give us some liquor and that fucking bitch gives us like, it probably was like four shots total maybe or something i don't know so we drank that and then i think we went back and had some more beers i'm not even sure i don't even remember but i do remember i mean we were fucked up dude like we were gone like we were avoiding everybody like we wouldn't i think we went around the party a, a little bit but i think we knew that we were like obviously drinking and for that age like holy fuck can you imagine being caught by your parents forget drinking getting fucked up at 14 years old I got called. I mean, I did, but we'll get to that. We get in that liquor. We start driving the golf cart around, and it was like a dewy night. Like, it was getting wet. And so we're driving down, like, a field, and it's, like, super slick, dude. Like, the dew. <coughs> Ew, dude. I just spit out some cucumber from the sushi I ate earlier. That's really unfortunate. We're driving down, we're driving down the um, field. Driving down the field. Kind of scooting. I mean, those things have limiters, so they can't go but so fast, but they can still get, I mean, they can go. We're scooting. I mean, we're going down. I really can't recall the details of like what happened from there on. I think we just went back to my house and maybe continue to drink. I don't remember. I, I remember this, and this is a really bad part to remember and super unforgivable. So for dinner, I think we were serving like spaghetti over there. You've thrown up spaghetti. I mean, maybe, like you probably have. I mean, don't be sitting there shaking your head like you probably have. At least admit it. If you're by yourself right now, just say like, yeah, I've done it before. Got fucked up, dude. Just drank way too much. Just went past the limit. Didn't know what I was doing. Your boy ends up on his back in the bathroom, vomiting like everywhere, dude. Like throwing up everywhere. I got off the carpet though. You're welcome. That was just like a, that was a teaser of like, yo, this boy's gonna be a drinker one day. He's gonna be a good drinker. <sighs> good, not really. So like, I mean, you can die from that. You can choke on your own vomit and I've never looked into it. Like, I don't know if it's like actually like super factual or if it's kind of like a more of a rare occurrence. Like if you just like, I don't even know, like you're just not adapted to live. Look, I, my cousin Dalton, the one that was drinking with me, the one we were getting reckless and kind of exploring adulthood, 
we were this two man pack going in, dude, and it was a one man pack. It was a one man pack coming out because I was in there throwing up, and Dalton literally just went back to the room and like sat down and watched TV or something. Like, didn't care that I was dying. It was chicken. I don't know what it was. It was. Maybe it wasn't spaghetti. I think it was chicken something. Either way, it was fucking gross. I don't know. I'm glad that I did not have to clean that up. That was the only, that was the silver lining of that whole situation is I made this horrible, nasty mess. I had to throw up like in my like hair, dude. Guarantee it was in my eyebrows. Like I was chilling. Like I had some, I had some throw up on me. And my cousin's boyfriend was coming in there to help me and like get undressed. And at that point, I think I had like vomited up like a, enough of the alcohol where like I was functioning and clearly angry. But he tried to do something and I like screamed out like I'm not fucking gay, which is like, why are you lying, bro? Like, what are, what are you lying about? That was, like, that was like suspicious, right? So then I took a shower and the next day, God, I don't know if, I know I felt like asshole. All right, guys, I've been wanting to tell this story for a while. I'm sorry it wasn't like super detailed. Time to get on off here. Why don't you come say bye? Say ciao, hasta la vista, baby. Please come and like and subscribe, and I'll see you later. It's not that boring. Chill. <laughs> Am I bald here? It looked like that the whole time. I don't know. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching, and make sure your kids don't get drunk when they're 13 and 10 months. <laughs>